Martens described a test for anterior subluxation of the tibia in 1981 that according to his article has the advantage of obviating apprehension and muscle spasms during test execution, avoiding false negative results. However, the test has not been formally assessed on its diagnostic accuracy against a reference standard, so the clinical value remains questionable. To conduct the test, the patient lies in supine position. The patient's lower leg is braced between your arm and body. Place one hand behind the tibia proximally and the other hand on the femur distally. The first step is the Lachmann maneuver where the tibia is pulled anteriorly and the femur posteriorly. Here, straight anterior subluxation of the tibia will be apparent in an ACL deficient knee. In the second step, add a valgus torque through the elbow at the patient's ankle, as well as internal rotation of the tibia. A positive test is indicated by a sudden snap of various degrees as the tibia subluxes anteriorly.